Hello everyone, how's it going? Dr. Incompetent here, and let's play some Backwoods Town, shall we? This game is in alpha. It's early, but I'd like to take a look at it and see what it's all about for the very first time. I'm going to put a link in the description below to the Steam page so you can check out the game. Uh, follow along on its development if you're interested. Let's dive in. World name? Well, we know. Here we go. All right, so it is day one, and I am, well, looks like just in the middle of the woods. And can I pick this up? I sure can. Pick up a stone. All right. So right away, you know, you see this top-down view, beautiful trees, and it looks like a building crafting, like, experience, third person. So let's see what we can do to build this up. I can chop a tree, but I don't have an axe, correct? So when you're, we're going to need to gather some, some stones and some branches, perhaps, to make that happen. So let's see. Uh, I can't mine that. I don't have a pickaxe yet. Fair enough. Oh, here's some food. Berries. I can't root it out because I don't have a shovel, but I can at least get some berries. So I see in the upper left I have a, a time meter, and it looks like I have health maybe... Uh, hunger and stamina? I'm not sure yet. Oh, here's some fiber. Alright, let's pick up the grass. And let's see here. I need to find something that's a little bit smaller. There's a berry. Alright, let's see. So, here's me. And if I want to craft, um, what can I make? Uh, I need twigs for all of these things. So let's try to find some twigs lying about, shall we? Maybe a small tree is what I need. Here we go. Here's a little tree. No, no, no. I gotta chop that. Well, maybe they're... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Twigs. What does it look like? Okay, it looks like a tree with no leaves. Okay, perfect. Can I now make um, a stone axe? I can. Hit me with an axe. Now I can get... This will be much easier. Life will be much easier. All right, we got a stone axe. And let's... Um, let's equip this. So I'm just using the mouse wheel or the num key. And then now... Chop, chop, chop. We got it. I got twigs. We got wood. Tree is down. Okay. So I could push C to craft again, and we can make a pickaxe, but we need stone. So let's go finding some stone. Pick that up. There we go. Here's some stones. Ooh, look, Looks like another biome up here. Is it a beach or something? Oh my god. It's a stone golem. Okay, I was not expecting this. I am not ready for a stone golem at all. I wonder if I can use my mining pick on him. What do we got? Sh okay, we need a shovel for sand. Fine. He's coming. He is slow, which is fortuitous. Alright, craft yourself a pickaxe. Good, we got one. Or did we get one? Oh, I think I might have... No. Okay, I need no more twigs is what I need. Uh, I don't have a sword. I wish I did. That would help me. Alright, let's go over here. And let's see. Um, oh, you can build. Campfire. Oh, cool. Look, you can build a house. We can start farming. This is all stuff that I want to do. Unfortunately, um, we're just in a bad space because... Uh, oh, no, I do have a pickaxe. It's right there. Great. It's just not on my hotbar because I think it must automatically equip it. 
Yeah. So you just pull it out. You don't need to actually hot hot key it. Alright. Stones are out. Let's see. The stone golem is here. He's angry. He smashed it. Okay. Ow, he punched me. Alright. Let's see if I can... Stone Golem, can you let me out of your domain? It doesn't look good for me getting out of his domain. I, I wandered in here too greedily. Okay, maybe I can mine on these. Can I pick... No, no way out. Okay. I'm just going to go have him kill me because um, I'm not ready. Ooh, but I can try to mine. I wonder if I can mine these. Is this coal? Okay. So we'll just load our last save. That's the simplest way to do this. So if that happens to you when you're playing the game, just know that it saves it right before you get in there, which is a godsend. Because that was bad. But now we know what's up there. A stone golem. He is angry. Okay, let's look at the map a bit. So this is all I've uncovered of the map. And here's the stone golem up here. I... Oh, I can destroy this. Um, oh, I need dynamite. Well, that would be helpful. But right now, let's just try to make ourselves a house, maybe. You know, get something up and off the beaten path as it were I'm actually right next to the beaten path is what I want so I'm going to go to build and I'm going to go into um, for crafting if I want a furnace or a charcoal pit looks like I need stone iron ingots a campfire this is good uh, yeah a workbench is we really need this. Let's just make one right here. And then... Um, I have this. But let's go to build. And let's see. Oh, okay. I can, so I can make stuff at the workbench. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can make armor. Great. Okay, look at all this stuff. This is perfect. All right. Um, now, instead, though, can I... Alcohol production. That is awesome. Okay. To make, like, a wooden wall, I'll need more wood farming. Um, yeah, let's just build, like, a... I don't know. I don't have... I guess I could plant berries, maybe. But we could just be, like... Yeah, I'm just kind of putting down a farming plot all over the place. There. There. Now, I need a shovel to do this, so we need to craft a, a shovel. I can't make one here, but I bet I can make one at um, the workbench. Ooh, a simple backpack. That's great. I actually can't make a shovel here. It might be something I need to use metal to make. So, we'll have to... Uh, get better at that. And oh, I can make a hoe. That's what we can dig with. So we'll just kind of craft this up. And I got a hoe. And then we'll dig this out with our hoe and the game automatically selects the tool that I need, which is great. Alright. And we can irrigate, but we need a watering can. Alright. That's fair enough. Okay, so um, I'm going to get some more wood. Let's build a house.
I got a bee. Maybe we can make some honey. Okay, wonderful. So, what does the backpack take? Fabric and threads. Ay, ay, ay. That's not going to happen for a while. Wooden plank, threads. Okay. So let me build... Let's try to build a house. Stone is a mile away, but we can maybe build, you know, a wooden wall. Um, and then... I would need glass to make windows. I would need wooden planks to make a door. So, we're just going to start this up. But, we don't have the fanciest materials just yet, because we need glass and such. And we saw some sand, but, you know, there was a mean guy in the way. So, let's see. If I want to craft a wooden sword, I could just craft it right now. That's actually easy. And we could craft a torch. Great. And let's go to our inventory, and let's put this sword... Well, I mean, do I need to equip it to my paper doll? I honestly don't know. What if I have this on? Am I going to fight? Yeah, 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 you can fight if you equip the sword. Okay, cool. What else can, do we want to build? Well, the watering can we can make right away to irrigate if we want to just start farming. I irrigated it. Okay, so now it's been irrigated, but I don't know... In terms of, you know, what I should do. Uh, I'm going to select this. So I can eat these berries. And you see the up in the upper left, the green bar, which must be my energy, is like replenishing. So that's good. But I don't know if I need to have special seeds to plant or what. I'm going to go around looking for some other stuff. Um... Pickaxe needed. Oh, did I not craft my pickaxe yet? I'm, I did not. I crafted it, that's right, when I when I died. When I was unceremoniously killed. By the world's meanest stone golem. Alright, so what did I get there? Coal and stone. I mean, that stuff is good. Let me go back to the workbench and let's just talk. What can I make? Um, a hammer. I should craft this. I don't know exactly what I'll need it for, but let's just get it. Maybe it's good for building other stuff. And then I now have um, everything made already up there. A bucket. I don't have what I need for that. A bow. I don't have a thread. Um, I don't have threads for that. Okay. And as far as crafting goes, no. But I can go to the building screen, and we can go to workstations. And if we wanted to build, you know... Okay, we need iron ingot to make a sawhorse. And a cooking table needs iron ingot. Um, we can make a, will a millstone with some stones. A paper press. The loom, okay spinning wheel. We need planks. Alchemist table. Wow, there's quite a lot of stuff. Okay, so let's see if we can... We need to make a furnace and a campfire. Let's get it going. Okay. And we'll just gather up all this.
Wonderful. Let me get this coal. Alright. So, I'm going to then build um, a fire. Wow, the lighting looks awesome on that. Okay, it's going. And uh, let me build any more stone. No problem. No stamina. Okay. Just going to eat a bunch of berries. Get back to work. It is getting late in the day. I was going to check about, like, you know, what does it take for me to craft a bedroll or something. Oh, I did get some iron ore. Perfect. All right, then if I make the um, furnace, we'll just kind of put it in here. And we'll open it. And we'll put in the iron ore. And we'll put in what? Charcoal? There it goes. It's filling up. It's doing it. Oh boy, it got dark. Sleeping place. Perfect. Hey, it ain't great, but I'm gonna sleep here. On a bunch of sticks. Nice. Alright, how's this going? Yeah, I got some iron. Amazing. Sweet. Alright, so I'm going to build then. We can build a well uh, to get water in the pond. I mean, that's all good. Electricity, that's awesome. But what we want to do at this point um, is just focus on Let's see. We have some iron. Here we go. Wait. Um, yes, we need the sawhorse. Okay. So I'm going to make wooden planks. I got sawdust and I got wooden planks. Tremendous. And then with planks, I can build um, a spinning wheel, a loom. I need more planks to do that. So if I want to make thread, I need cotton. Okay. So that's what we got to go find. I can't make any, many more planks than that just yet. That's okay. If I go to build, though, I can now make a, a fruit press. Okay. I'll build it all. Whatever. Fruit press me. Uh, we can make berry juice, but we need a bucket and a bunch of berries. Okay. Let me get. We're gonna need to cut down some more trees. Oh, did my axe break? Okay, there we go. Yeah, it has durability. Timber. Awesome.
you know, it's... I like the pace at which you can chop down trees in this. It's pretty good. I like that there's no... You have a pretty big inventory um, starting out. And there's no weight or anything. I'm good. I'm good with that. All right, let's see. Um, uh, we can build a cooking table. Seems nice. I can make dough. Yeah, that's cool. Um, let me continue building my house. I need a pretty big house because I got a lot of crafting stations to build. This doesn't even necessarily have to be my house. It's just a temporary structure. Um, you know, I don't know if I can just move this thing. Oh, yeah, you can. Great. Yeah, I want to move this workbench back here. And put this cooking bench table next to it. Um, this still should go outside. But great. Love that. This is a really slick building interface. I like it. Stuff places really quickly. Very nice. How much wood do I have? Zero. I've used it all. Take the twigs. You need them. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and do two and see if I, there we go, now we've got a bunch of planks, what can we build? Oh, I can put in flooring, I didn't even see that before, yes, oh man, that looks awesome, cool. Stone floor actually looks, we should probably put a stone floor um, here. I'm going to take the refund. I need stone floor under the fire. I mean, I, I, I can't... I can't have that make sense. Wood floor other places is fine, but come on. Oh my goodness, you see that? The tree hit the other tree, and it knocked it down, like in Valheim. I love it. It's my favorite. All right, we need to craft another um, axe. That's fine. All right, my house is really coming along. People everywhere are very impressed. All right, um, oh wait, farming. Is this the apiary? Oh, yeah, I got enough for a bee house. I just need some more planks. Trust me, they're coming. Now, I am running low on food. All right, I built this. Now, I don't know what it's going to do and how it's going to produce honey, but I built it. So we're going to need to run around and select, get, just gather berries and such. Oh my god, pickaxe. I'm out of stone. That's easy. Just find some. Oh, there's a bird. 
Oh, look, what'd he drop? He dropped carrot seeds. Oh, great, I can farm. It's kind of like in, uh, you know, don't starve when the birds drop stuff, kind of. All right, we need another pickaxe for sure. Awesome. Where's my house? It's over here. Love this map. Now, I could make some juice. I don't... Let's see. Like... Oh, I need a bucket. I think I can make a bucket, though. I need iron. But I think I have some iron. I do. Here, go here. Make that bucket. Oh, we need planks. Make a bucket. We got one. No stamina. All right. Yes. Berry juice. No stamina. Let's make it. We got it. Now let me see. Berry juice is plus 80. Stamina. Whoa, look at that. It basically filled up my entire bar. Yes. And I keep the bucket. That's awesome. Sweet. All right. Looking good. But I want to build, obviously, more flooring, maybe some roof, and some more crafting stations to see how we're doing. So let me go ahead and mine this coal here. You can get some stone from this. Awesome. And let's go over here. There we go. So I might need to get some more berries because you can see I'm running out of stamina. Um, but the day is also, you know, passing. So I could just sleep. I need that dynamite. We got to destroy that stuff. It's crashing my party. All right, good. Okay, so if we want to build anything new, um, the charcoal pile will require some clay. That's fine. Uh, we'll need copper wire for that, so we're not even remotely close to that. That's okay. Oh, look, you can make a storage chest. Oh, and a nicer bed, but I do need that fabric. So we need a bunch of planks for that. Let me go ahead and put in some stone flooring. Just to complete my dream of this whole back area being like the crafting area, maybe, you know, and you have some stone flooring. But then for the rest of it, we can probably get away with um, just flooring like this. And we'll go back to walls and uh, we will rotate this wall. And we can, you know, start to bring this in. And then we're going to go to... Uh, wood flooring for where we sleep and other things. So this is really looking good. And you can see my stamina actually came back. So it just regenerates, which is really cool. It's not like Stardew or something where it's just, you know, sitting there and just is permanently down until you you know, eat or rest. You do, if you are idle, it regenerates. I really like that.
Amazing. It's getting dark. Oh, fireflies. Cool. I wonder if I can capture those. I probably need a bottle, which would require glass, which I do need sand as well. Um, I have a torch. Um, how do I use it, though? I wonder how to hold it. Maybe you have to put it on the hot bar. It doesn't... Unless... Yeah, okay, you put it on... You select it, and you left-click it, and then now you're holding it. Sweet, now I could see. Great. Uh, my house is back down here. I went too far. All right, here's home sweet home. All right, let's go ahead and sleep. Now it's raining. Good for my crops. Actually, speaking of crops, I do have um, some seeds that I got. So we can plant these. And then there's some carrots in there. Do I need to put the bee in the house? No, maybe just over time it just produces honey. And then it, like, it'll show me, like, hey, there's honey here, and I pick it up. Well, everybody, I think this is a great first look at backwoods town and i think this game is just a super chill way to spend some time you know you get um a great feel to the game of you know yeah there's um whoa whoa there we go some stardew to it of course but you also have some unique elements with electricity and things and i like how the stamina system is working in the game and I'd love to know what you think of Backwood Town. I'm going to put um, a link in the description below to the Steam page so you can check it out, follow it along, wishlist the game if you're interested. And everybody, share your comments below about your impressions so far of the game, and I'd love to chat with you about it. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.